Let's shift gears to safety and performance. The most impactful tool in this category is Stud Span. This replaces the classic C style pattern of passing a pointer and a length. Now, obviously, you can still do that, or you can pass a reference to specific containers. But Stutzpan gives you a standard vocabulary for a sequence of data. It's lightweight, literally just a pointer and a size, but it carries that size information with it automatically. It means you can write one function that accepts a std vector, a std array, or a row c array without any extra boilerplate. Then we have constival. This solves a specific problem with constxpr. Sometimes you write a constxpr function expecting it to run at compile time, but you accidentally pass it a runtime value, and it silently runs at runtime instead, resulting in slowing down your app. Constival prevents that accident. It forces the evaluation to happen immediately, hence the name immediate function. It's perfect for things like parsing static strings or validating configuration constants. If the input isn't known at compile time, the build simply fails. Finally, for concurrency, we have std jfred. It's essentially a std thread that cleans up after itself. With the old std thread, if you forgot to join before the destructor ran, the runtime would call std terminate and kill the program. When std jfred goes out of scope, it automatically requests stop and joins. It also standardizes thread cancellation. Instead of using a custom boolean flag to tell a thread to exist, jfred provides a built-in stop token. It's cooperative, meaning your thread has to check it. But it finally gives us a standard way for stopping tasks. 